Welcome back to Voodoo Spells and More once again here with another love binding video. Um, these are the ones that are getting the most views, the most comments. So I figured we keep on with these and then just take it from there as we go along, okay? For this particular love binding spell, you're going to need a pink candle, a toothpick, a piece of brown paper. A picture of you and a picture of him I drew these just for the sake of the video you do not use drawings you use actual pictures okay and some black thread all right so let's get started you're gonna take your toothpick and your pink candle and you're gonna write his name going this way so let's do this Just so you can see, you're going to carve it in there. The best that you can. And we're going from the bottom up, okay? His name. I don't know how good you guys can see that. And a cross going from left to right. You're going to write your name so that it forms a cross even if it overlaps his name okay y'all have to excuse my cats i told you i lock them up when i'm doing my videos so they don't get hurt with you know the flames of the candles and stuff like that so all right it looks like this his name like this and then your name on top of his forming a cross you see this okay we're gonna light this candle always use wooden matches okay lots of energy it's a natural energy when we do this. I always do this so my candles stay put, okay guys? Please always use precaution when using candles. All right, so a candle standing straight up. I'm gonna light it. Light this candle. Wait till the flame is going nice. Oh, this one turned off. Hold on, I'll show you guys in a second. Okay, my flame is burning. Let's see, like this, okay? Sorry. Now what you're gonna do here, once your flame is burning this way, you're going to put your hands, both hands, over the flame. And you're going to say his and your name three times and that you want to love bind. So I, Jane Doe, am love binding with this candle work, John Doe. I, Jane Doe, am love binding with this candle work, John Doe. Three times, okay? <clears throat> We're going to leave this lit for a minute so we can continue with... What else we have to do? Okay. So you're gonna take your brown piece of paper and you're gonna write his name. This spell works for women and men, men to men and women to women, okay? Because I get those questions a lot. So you're gonna write his name And then on a, across, you're gonna write your name. Again, here, I'm gonna make this paper smaller. Remember, your brown paper has to have the edges ripped up by you, not with scissors. 
So his name and then your name going across. We're making a cross, okay? You're gonna take your candle and you're gonna cover the names with wax. And all the while you're invoking, you want him to be stuck to you, binded to you. He belongs to you. So as you cover the names, it should as well look like a cross. I'll show you guys this in a minute. Let me put my candle back down. All right, I'm setting my candle back down so it stays in place. Letting my wax dry on my paper here. Just about done. If you guys have a particular spell of, sorry, prayer you want to say with your spells, your love spells, go ahead by all means. There's no wrong way to do it. If that's what you feel you need to do, your spirit's telling you, do it. I have some optional prayers that we can say. I love using um, St. Martha for domination. I mean, she's wonderful when it comes to love binding. So you guys want to add your little twist? Be my guest. There's no wrong way. Okay, now we're going to take his picture and her picture, your picture. Don't laugh at my drawings. I know they're funky. And you're going to put them face to face. Face to face. Here's your paper with the names covered in wax. And you're going to put the pictures on top. On top of this, and you're going to roll it. Sorry, I'm rolling towards me. I want this to come to me. I want him to come to me and be binded to me. So it should rolled up, be rolled up like this. Here's where the black thread comes in. You're gonna take your black thread. I'll take a piece. And you're gonna kind of wrap it like around. And remember, you're wrapping towards you, okay? When you're finished wrapping it, it doesn't have to be the whole thing covered or anything like that. Just enough to keep this paper with the pictures together. You're gonna tie three knots, one, and the third knot and as you tie these knots you're like as I tie these knots I'm tying you to me you belong to me and you will be binded to me so you're gonna leave this right here right next to your candle what's gonna happen next you're gonna leave this candle and let it burn all the way down now of course You'll probably have some wax on top of here. You're gonna have some type of little wax residue, which is perfect. Cause you're gonna take the little package, you're gonna take the remaining wax and you're gonna put this under your bed or inside of your pillowcase for seven days. It stays there, don't touch it, don't move it, leave it for seven days. Once the seventh night is over, you're gonna take it out from where you had it and you're gonna set it, everything on fire. Just all has to burn. This and whatever remainder of wax. If it sets on fire, good. If it doesn't, the thing is, this has to burn. It's very important. Once you have the ashes of this, you spread them outside in the grass, but outside of your house. It has to be outside of your house, outside of the front door, because he's gonna come to you. He's gonna, um, want to be binded to you, always want to be like right there with you. So this is going to bring him. Remember, it has to stay 
under your bed or in your pillowcase seven days. On the seventh night, take it out, set this on fire, ashes go under the bed. I hope you guys enjoyed this spell. I love giving you guys spells that you can, you know, use common household items. I sound like a broken record, but it's just better that way. It's natural. You can do it yourself. And I love it. <laughs> All right, guys. Don't forget to follow us on Facebook at Voodoo Spells Tarot and More. Hit that like and subscribe button here if you want more free videos on spells and tarot readings and stuff like that. You can find me as well on Instagram at Voodoo Spells 707. And I also offer personal work for people that aren't able to cast in their home or just don't have the time. So for personal work, hit my email at voodoospells at icloud.com. Okay, guys, you have a good night.